Virgin Mary apparitions not always real, says Pope after statue row. Pontiff appears to reference a woman who drew pilgrims to a statue near Rome she claimed shed tears of blood. Apparitions of the Virgin Mary are not always real, Pope Francis has said. In what appears to be an indirect reference to a woman who drew thousands of pilgrims to a town near Rome to pray before a statue that she claimed shed tears of blood. Don't look there, the pontiff said during an interview with Rai One on Sunday when asked about apparitions of the Virgin Mary. There are images of the Madonna that are real, but the Madonna has never drawn to herself, he said. I like to see her with her finger pointing up to Jesus. When Marian devotion is too self-centered, it's not good. Both in the devotion and in the people who carry it forward. The interview was aired a few days after residents in Trevignano called on Francis to intervene against Maria Giuseppe Scarpola, who has been nicknamed the Saint and Clairvoyant. For five years she has organized monthly ceremonies in a park overlooking Lake Bracciano where a statue of the Virgin Mary sits in a glass case. The statue was bought by Scarpola, known to her followers as Gisela Cardia, at a Catholic pilgrimage site in Medjugorje, Bosnia. Upon returning to Italy, she claimed the Madonna made apparitions, wept tears of blood and was communicating messages to her. Marco Salvi, a local bishop, last week urged pilgrims to stop flocking to the site on the third of each month while his diocese investigates the phenomena surrounding the statue. Many people prayed before the statue in search of cures for serious illnesses. Scarpola is facing a judicial investigation after a private investigator alleged that the blood stains on the statue came from a pig and after some of her followers claimed they had been scammed. Scarpola, who in the past had been convicted of bankruptcy fraud, created a foundation through which she collected donations, which she reportedly said would go towards setting up a center for sick children. One man told La Repubblica that he and his wife had donated 123,000 euros to her foundation. We were both ill, we trusted her, it was a clamorous error, he said. Scarpola fled Trevignano in early April amid the furor only to return a few weeks later. She still hosts the ceremonies, although Saturday's event was reported to be a flop, with only a handful of people in attendance. She said last month that she was undeterred by the investigation as well as an order for the glass case to be demolished.